We warmly welcome each and every one of you to the inaugural program of the Miraculum Society. The Miraculum Society was started by former Miss in 2019, Yukon Satya, with the purpose of promoting and spreading the education. It served as an outlet where people can contribute and help group or civil societies who are in dire need of help. Today, we shall witness the inaugurations of this organization into an official NGO. Before that, I would like to take a special time to acknowledge our guests. You think the only people who are people of a stranger you learn things you never knew you never knew have you ever had the wolf cry to the blue gun moon or asked a greedy bucket why he agreed can you see with all the voices of the mountains can you paint with all the colors of the wind purpose is to work in some of the most remote areas in the state and beyond the boundaries. The NGO mainly focuses on child support and education, youth engagement, and rural development. In fact, we have also started a project in Nokla called the Project CCC, Creative Center for Children Nokla, which further my fellow colleague will be speaking more about it. Nabilan still being very new to this world, taking its baby steps each day, growing, learning, and falling at the same time, we have seen various communities coming together to accept changes, yet still wanting to stay very closely rooted to our culture and traditions. It is wonderful, it is wonderful to see people coming together to a movement where you can do so much in the very little ways of your own kind. Such as that, the main purpose of this NGO is to provide opportunities for study and research to make the findings available to anyone by arranging educational seminars and meetings. To also offer cooperation and assistance to schemes which are in accordance with object of society, whether such schemes are undertaken by the state or the central government, by public or other agencies. The main aim is to actively engage the youth in educational institution and not forgetting spiritual development. Also to promote cultural understanding amongst the people, amongst the people such with such trust or societies. It is an outlet where people can contribute and help a group or a certain societies who are in need of help. We hope that this NGO, the Miraculum Society Nagaland, will serve a lifelong ministry to our people, at the same time to impact young minds and as we conduct projects and programs around and across our state and even outside, we hope that we can have community participation which is very important so that this NGO will not just help in areas that matters but also to teach compassion towards acceptance and love for mankind. Ivy Konya Satsu, 20 year old, proudly present you my own, the Miraculous Society in Ireland. I know it is not easy, you know, in Nagaland, the society we have numerous in terms of thousand and probably a lack in must reach, but it's only the few that is actually doing the great job. And I know that it needs guts, it needs a lot of contemplation, it needs a lot of sacrifice to actually stand and say that I'm going to do something and bring some transformation. I'm happy that we could, with the beauty and the purpose, she could do that. 
And I know that, I have faith that she can do better because I can see that a lot of her co-workers and helpers and the blessing will be all on you. And the wonderful name you have chosen, I will say that, the miracle. And probably I will say that on the other side. <clears throat> you have chosen a lovely, is it a bunion tree? I don't know what tree it is. But it is a tree and it's, it's a good significance. And it says that purpose to nurture and build. We all know that nature is very rough, tough, and we need to fight always against the odds. The nature is something which we try to always take under control, but it's not possible. But the other hand, if we think of nature, it's control. We can tune it to our destiny, desire, and to make a nurturing things possible. I know a good hands, good mind and a good heart can truly nurture anything that is beyond possible imagination. I hope the miracle of that the particular statement that we have given brings a lot of reformation to the nurturing of our society and also beyond our state boundaries without having any reason. In India and Myanmar, it is the youngest district of Nagaland, inaugurated on the 20th of January 2021 as the 12th district. As rich with resources their land is, so are the people rich in skills and knowledge. Their expertise in woodcraft and handicraft, their vast agricultural knowledge is truly something to be appreciated. The people there are very deeply bound to their cultural roots, which while also being very firm Christians. Being the youngest district of Nova, they have a whole lot of untapped potential and thus needs a little nudge to get on par with the rest of the older districts. It is the fact that developments are being introduced to when we want to contribute to it too. This is where the CCC project by the Miraculous Society comes into the picture. So on behalf of the Task Force for Music and Arts, the Government of Nagaland, we are very happy to partner with the CCC and uh, it is our pride and honor to inaugurate this project. in my heart, I'm yet to meet someone as young as Vic uh, but with, with so much clarity of the, uh, of the vision of what she wants to do with her life. So I'm very, very proud of you and continue to do the good work. And Task Ta Force of Music and Arts is very, very honored to partner with you. And we will do whatever we can in our capacity to, 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 to see that this dream grows and that our children in Mokla uh, their talents are discovered and promoted, not just in Nagaland, but across the borders. So, uh, with the Lord's help, we will work together in the days to come. Uh, taking this opportunity, I would like just like to share a few thoughts, especially to all my young friends who are here. Just three thoughts, will be very short. And the number one thought I want to share with you is continue to dream big. And I met Vicon the other day in my office and she said, when I was eight years old, I had a dream that I would one day be Miss Nagaland. That was the dream that she decided at the age of eight, the very tender age of eight. And exactly after 10 years, she becomes the Miss Nagaland in 2019. And today, she's grown up to be a beautiful woman with a beautiful, miraculous dream that's going to affect and touch thousands of lives. So dream, dreaming big, dreaming and dreaming big matters. And to all the young people I would say, never stop dreaming. In fact, it was the late uh, president of India, Abdul Kalam, he said, to dream small is a crime. And that has always been my, my go-to uh, uh, inspiration as a dreamer myself. Talking about dreams, I'm also reminded of the Tetsuo sisters. All of you know them, they're just so famous all over India, and the, in the, the world is also starting to take uh, sort of uh, 
notice of them. Google chose five personalities in a, in a population of one billion plus people in India. Five stories, only five stories. They were one of them. Their story was featured uh, in the creating for India, in the YouTube, how people are creators are using YouTube to earn money, to create contents, to impact lives. And that is a huge moment for Natalie. It's, I'm very proud to say that from our fraternity, music and the arts. And they, they make all of us so proud. Sir Andrew has already told us a little bit about the Everest episode. Who other than Dr. Andrew could dream of a fashion show above the Everest base? Not the base, he went above. He just confirmed it. And I think since he's here, he needs a round of applause. <laughs> now, if we don't dream, we don't achieve. The Tetchos have achieved, Dr. Andrew has achieved, and also his book is out. His book is out. Just about some few months back, all of you uh, must have read or seen in the social media how five Naga artists were chosen there to be sure influencers. 